hey, hey, hey. Hey, yo, hey, yo. Yo, we outside. It's so nice we outside. We outside today. We outside today. We do that thing where we talk about doing. What's oh, that? Baby, we can't say it right now. We can't, uh -uh. can't put that out there, now. We can't put it in the atmosphere. Yeah. But we definitely, that'll be, uh, that'll be on point. We're okay. going to talk about it, but we're going to work on yeah, it. Yeah, we're going to work, work on, on it. it. Mm -hmm. Baby, is she in here? I'm trying to, yeah, I'm trying to take it. It's so nice. It is. It feels so good. It's not too hot. It it's feels good. good. It's like you can look out the window. I'm looking out the window mm -hmm. out the window in the morning. I'm like, you can tell Paul on his way. It be looking Paulish out the window. Yeah, it does. But I'm with mm -hmm. this. It's nice. It's really nice. It is. Yeah, but thank y'all for tuning in. Yeah, I really and want you to see that because we I hate it. that we missed y'all last time. Sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> sorry, y'all. I forgot to put my phone on Do Not Disturb because it's the time that they like to call me. We do. Because the Why color is looking so good, don't it? Good we must got this in the uh, 5K or something. It's something, baby. It's, it's doing what it needs to be doing. Yeah. <laughs> it's giving what it's supposed to give. So y'all share this so we can get started. Share, like, share, like, share, like. Y'all, today I am wearing... This is my Uncle Tuck. <laughs> People from the College Station community know Tuck, L.B. Porter. This is my uncle. And I decided to honor him. And this shirt says, Unleash Your Inner Tuck. With a glass of drink. My Uncle Tuck loved to drink. Um, unfortunately, he was known in the neighborhood kind of as a drunk, but okay, he was drunk. But I still love my Baby, that's why you are never. Hey, bro. Ever, <laughs> ever. Whatever, well, what? Get to talk at my film. Because <laughs> let me tell you You what. tell too much stuff. But he was. You, are you didn't even have to put this. See, you are never going to say. But it's on the show. Baby, what I say. Wait it's on the show. He didn't say he was a drunk. <laughs> But it said unleash your inner tuck. And but I it didn't say he was a drunk. Sit down. <laughs> that's why I said you would never. <laughs> Hey, Rhonda, you will never get to speak at myself. I'm telling you, I, I, I'm going to write it all down to my daughter, and I want her to be specific to say who can get up and talk and who can't. I already said none of my family members can get up and talk because they don't say words right. You definitely can't get up and talk because you talk too much. But back to my uncle. But then talk. I want to make sure that my daughter don't let people talk who act like they like me and my daughter know for a fact they didn't like me right. that I ain't like them because she know if I ain't like them, she know they ain't like me. So we're going to squash all that. But I'm just letting everybody know the but story. But you said he was a drunk. He was. He had a, he had an was issue. It was a, well, it's on my website. If you go on the it website, he was a drunk. go to Hot Cheese Couture. Hot it cheese. didn't say he was a drunk. H-A-U-T-E-T-E-E-S Couture, C-O-U-T-U-R-E dot com. And you can order Thank your... Thank you. He enjoyed his beverages. Thank you, Ryan. She'll <laughs> never get to talk. At my film, at my wake, she ain't talking at nothing. <laughs> so if y'all like get a good award, drink, never get to accept if y'all like a drink, and got a family member who like a drink, go to Hot Tees Couture and order the Tuck T-shirt and unleash your uh, inner Rhonda, can, can you be her uh, <laughs> PR so she know what to say and what not to say? Hey, everybody, look, I don't sugarcoat nothing. I say what it is. And I love my... Uncle. Okay, so let me tell y'all this. <laughs> She she tell you what it is, but Tiki will eat somebody food that she know good and doggone well it didn't taste good. And would. We'll, Tell them that it was good instead of telling them the truth that it was not it was not good. See what I'm saying? She have tell the truth. <laughs> See, she said she can't because I don't need help with this. Thank one. you, Rhonda. Thank thank you. Thank See, you. You don't tell the truth about none instead of eating folks stuff and it don't be good. It does. It don't. Yeah, we do we do have a lot of those issues that I, and that's so ironic that you pulled that up that, that you pulled that out and said that because in the car I was saying from now on when people tell me a place is good. Let me be the judge. I got of a it. checklist. One, I need to know how old you are. Were you raised by your grandmother? That's did your grandma so. wear a moo moo? Because see, if your grandmother didn't fit the characteristics of grandmothers back in the eighties, I can't trust your judgment. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Cause some of the stuff you name, I know somebody like that. And they still can't cook. They fix me a plate one day and baby, I, I'm gonna take it to go. And baby, I got on Interstate 40 and honey and slung it right out that window. Yeah, so they can have all them things and still can't, still cook. can't cook. And 
I don't care when yeah. I just give up. House dress. Yeah, they're right there. <laughs> they still can't cook. Well, they can have this hanging. Was that, that shaking? And she still can't. Still can't cook. Okay. Well. Well, thank you guys for joining us. Tune in, tune in, share like, share like, share like. Get your people over here because we got some things to talk about. What's up, Stephanie? Hey, honey. <laughs> hey, Stephanie. <laughs> well, honey, look. I heard re- uh, you ain't going to ask. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. I want to say this to Stephanie. Stephanie, shout out to you, honey. You have been doing really great things. I'm super proud of you oh, with yeah. the Urbane Magazine and all yes. that. Yes. With your, with your features and all. So, you know, keep on moving, honey. Keep, keep on, on moving. moving. Don't stop. Mm-hmm. Right. Keep on okay. moving. Don't stop. Don't just get me to that part because that's what that's, I know. You was rushing to get there. Get it out of here. Go <laughs> ahead. Take it home. <laughs> <laughs> well, baby. <laughs> in local news, baby, they said UAMS did a whole Rico and damn near cleaned out the whole hospital. So, um, if y'all looking for a job, it's some jobs. It's some they jobs. Job, they probably jobbing now. They jobbing. They yeah, jobbing. Some of these jobs ain't jobbing. And y'all might not want to get admitted because it may not be nobody that'll care for y'all for a little minute. Mm. Yeah, they, they did a, a big clean out, baby. Yeah, you know what? And I wonder if, like, who all went. I'm sure it was probably some. What level ones, level two? But honey, I wonder if it was like some big people too. You know what I'm I saying? I know, cause like at all tell, it was everybody, baby. It was from the bottom to the top when they did that big layoff about that email and stuff. Around. You know that's crazy. That's crazy. I just really hate that. You know that all that went down like that. You know, cause I think what one was a nurse and then what you call it just graduated nursing school. Oh, she graduated. You know, and then got a battery. You getting a battery charge? You know what I'm saying? Like, how's they gonna sit? So that's why I want to put my hands on nobody because I don't want my concealed carry license took from me. I want to keep that on at all costs. Right. So I try not to fight. Yeah. Because we be needing it. I mean, because she keeps her pistol on her. (laughs) It's it's sitting right here next to her right now. Right now. My dear don't have nothing on this one. Don't leave home without it. Remember, we some shooters. I should have brought my thing so they could saw my from the from the gun range. Okay. I'll leak the shots. But anywho. Okay, y'all. Prayers to everyone that was on the Brazil flight. Did you see that video, friend? Oh, yeah, where that plane was going to the nose died. Yes, that is so sad. Ooh, but you know, when I got what you said when you was like your fear, like that is a fear of mine to be on there and you know you fall into your death. Like when a person, like me and Tika can make comments on social media. And for some reason, out of them 25,000 comments, we they come to our comment and want to argue with us. And like, they were telling you what? Yeah, uh, I got into so a whole argument, y'all. My, my post was, this is why I fear flying. That's it, that's all. Somebody comes back. You know that's stupid, right? You can die in a car crash. Then I said, look here, I know this. And I had all day yesterday, but they didn't come back. I was just saying, I know the statistics of being in a car wreck versus a plane crash. Mm-hmm. But I don't want to see myself fall into my I, I can't. A car crash, you can boom, yeah. you go instantly just like that. Don't even see it coming. But you're diving you know. knowing you're mm-hmm. going to have an impact. You're just waiting. I, that's, yeah. Mm-hmm. But you know, they say with the, the pressure change, a lot of the times the people pass out or have heart attacks. So I really hope that's true. But we'll never See, know. See, that flying just ain't looking too good for me no more. Mm-mm. I'm like, I had a lot of places to go, but it don't look like I'm going to get there. It popped up on my phone. American Airlines had to turn around again because they bathroom overflowed again. See, I haven't seen where, where one of the airplanes, the wheel was turned around the wrong way. Mm-hmm. It's just like it's always something. Doors coming off. They must got some young folks working on these planes now that don't want to work. You know, and then they in there mad. They probably got rolled up. You know how we do we get rolled up yeah. and stuff? Yeah. I'm like, I don't know what's going on. Well, they said that CEO was sending all these jobs overseas, you know, because he wanted to keep his $42 million a year, but everybody else hadn't had a raise in over 10 years, I think it was. But he, he got one last year. I think they said he, his raise was like a 40% raise. Yes, yeah, and that's not cool. And that's what I don't like, too, with these jobs, you know, how they sit up there and they waste money on stupid stuff. Mm-hmm. But then instead of putting that money to your employees, and you do that, then they will perform better. You know, yes. you would have better, you know, a better staff. But then y'all want to keep the money to yourself. Like, it's crazy. What's up, Jay? Jay? <laughs> hey, manager. And and I get what you're saying because um, 
and what I do, I, I see that firsthand, and it really does bother me at times because I see how we spend money, but mm -hmm. then it's never like enough for the employees mm -hmm. to get yeah, raises. Well. But I look at how we spend. I know? mean, just like even with this one um, department I was in, there was money that was always left over, but and one of the people was just like, well, why don't you give, you know, Christmas bonuses and stuff like that? But that little slob and mouth, little bald headed. Honey, didn't even want to do with child. That's why they at home now. <laughs> little slob and little self. You look like the slob. <laughs> Let me know when you're done. I'll be back. <laughs> I mean, like, didn't even want to do nothing, you know, give to your to your staff. But you slob all day. But this cool. Are you done? <laughs> or, or, I'm finished. Or are you finished? I'm finished. Okay, you are but you know, I'll get started back again. And uh, you know, I don't mind talking about them because ain't nothing they can do to me no way. Because I, I get them now. That's right. You have to pour it to your employees. Yes. Exactly. Yes. You know, they say Jada Waiter, she hiring, she paying $20 an hour. And okay, I'm trying Jada. to find her little job. I wonder if she has something virtual. That's what I was looking for. Mm. <laughs> That's a nice start. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's, she's young, an hour. Mm -hmm. and she knows to do that. Yeah. Well, baby, since we're talking about money, now this has been in the news. I think we covered it a couple of years back, but it's back. It's in the news. It's back, as Broadway Joe said. Uh, so this man said he and his wife spent 200 k on their wedding, so he is charging $450. Not going. And that's what he said. Everybody declined the invitation. He said, but yet... Y'all paid three hundred up to a thousand dollars to go see Beyonce and Chris Brown, but y'all yeah, won't support gonna, us. Honey, them weddings don't last. Beyonce gonna do another concert again. We just gonna go and go back to that. <laughs> but no, we're not paying for their wedding. No, that's what I thought. I said, is he just trying to get their money back? Uh, that's not what it is. He's trying to get us to pay for the wedding. Because I mean, like with my wedding, you know, I wanted my folks to come out, eat, have fun, and all that different. So the only thing my my bridesmaids had to pay for was their dress. Right. And I made sure that it was a cost that wasn't too expensive. I don't, the dresses, I don't think they even were over 100 I don't think. Hmm. Or whatever. So, I don't know. Girl, these folks be doing too much. So, yeah, I was like, yeah, that is a little insane. So, they went to the Justice of the Peace. Yeah, he's on Instagram. He mad about it. I meant to share it on that yeah, page that's when they should have just went and just had a reception. I wonder, can he get his money back? Because if ain't nobody going to be there, and yeah, it is his fault. <laughs> so, people just be doing stuff. He probably doing that for social media for clout. You got to be. I don't know because this is somebody how else did that yeah, before. Yeah, we talked about it. But it was fifty dollars. Look at my cousin Shaquita. Was it fifty dollars? I can't remember it, but he was charging. I think it was fifty or something like that. I forgot what it was. Uh, I don't know. But honey, yeah, if you can't afford to get married, just don't do it. Just don't do it. That's it. Now, friend, what you think about these Olympics? Baby, look, I'm going to tell you, friend, I don't never watch sports. Okay. But, baby, I watch that basketball. And I love the gymnastics. And I, I love, love the history play. Yeah, I, I love the floor it. stuff. I like that. And um, all the balance beam and, you know, anything with gymnastics, I like that. I can't, I like the basketball, but I really got into basketball once we went to see the Lakers play. Okay, yeah. You know, in L.A., yeah. and I really love basketball now. But the girls that's coming out, uh, Asia Wilson and... Uh, that Flo J girl and all them right. and Angel Reese, I'm loving them girls. Like yeah. they bringing it and just to see them flourish like that. So baby, I was I had to go. To, I was going to church, but a book played it back for me. I could watch the highlights and they won. Like USA has been going over there getting the gold, baby. baby. We've you been hear getting me? It. They've We've been, been getting it back. Now the one thing that I cannot watch is that synchronized swimming at a party because baby, I be on the couch about to die because I be sitting over there holding my breath like a fool. So as soon as they go in, I'm holding my breath, and then I'm just over there like. Well, you just trying to see how long you can hold it or something? No, it's just some of when people go underwater, I hold my breath. And girl, I can't watch it, so when they come on, I get off and then go watch something else. Because I literally be sitting there holding my breath, about to fall out. So I can't watch that, that synchronized swimming. It'd it be about to take me out. But USA went over there and kicked butt, like track and field. And I wish I would have oh, yeah. stayed in track. Me I too. ran track over at Forest Heights, and I wish I would have stayed in it. But that Shakari, like, baby, the way she looked at that, she looked at me, like, you know, I got this. I got it. Coming up on so, it. Like, it was really good. And I was watching track and field, too, but I was getting a lot of, I was getting distracted because a lot of those guys with prints were showing, and I couldn't stay focused to the race. 
I had to keep rewinding it back so I could watch the race, but then I got distracted again. So you just should have left that one alone. <laughs> I kind of had to because I was like, "We should have left that alone." <laughs> but yeah, USA went over there. Like, uh, and the girls when they played against France, they won by one point. That girl thought that she shot a three pointer, but she only ended up being a two pointer because oh. her foot was on the line. Oh. They, they won by one point. Baby, wow. my husband said them girls was crying. France was in tears. My dad said Step them showed out. He said Step did some baby. He was doing some he did twenty four three pointers, twenty four points in three pointers. Excuse me, baby. Step was getting down. I was like, okay, wow. Mm-hmm. Hey, Parkin. Erica said, hey, Parkin. Hey, hey, hey. hey, hey. hey, hey. 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 How are you doing? <laughs> but. But I think the Olympics was doing a little too much too, because why they put break dancing in there, y'all? I Brand. think they were just trying to make up and just fill in some spots because that was crazy. Was the Jabberwockies over there too? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't watch any. I got. I, I missed that a was, lot. That was some crazy stuff right there. Yeah. Because I asked my husband, "Where they put it?" Because he was trying to see too. We were both sitting up there posing, like, "When they start putting that in there?" But they already said this is the last time y'all gonna see it. It ain't gonna be in there next year. So oh, okay. They should have never back. done it. Yes, a mess. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> I was like, my God. <laughs> I'm like, honey, they going to have skateboarding in their necks and some more stuff, ain't they? I, they better put cheerleading. If they do anything else, cheerleading needs to be in there since it is officially a sport now. So I don't even know why it was not in there mm-hmm. this but year. But do they have it over there, though? Well, they should. If they have the basketball teams, then they should have something. I mean, um, could have been over there doing those basket toss, doing those. Baby, now, I did watch the volleyball because I like volleyball because I got a cousin. Corky was a beast in volleyball. Really? Corky girl. Oh, we need to do, we need to come She was on, a Corky. beast. Now, I ain't saying she got it now, but she was then. This is like when I did a track then. I ain't got it now, girl. I can't right. run like that. I can't need the honey. Mm-mm. I was watching the guys, though, and I was amazed because I guess I'm so used to seeing women play volleyball. So when mm-hmm. I was seeing the guys, I was just so amazed how how the ball was going up because mm-hmm. I'm like, they're tall mm-hmm. and they have you know, more stress. I'm like, dang, that ball going up there. Yeah. But they be playing it. Yeah. But yeah, USA was, they was bringing home the gold. I'm really, I was really proud. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I was watching a video on my way, and I'm like, I wonder who made up the fan thing and the line dances, because that, that really irritates me. I mean, they can't do line dances no more without popping that loud-ass fan. I was just, I saw that video, and I was like, that never wear Friend, me out. I'm going to tell you the dance that I hate. <laughs> is that dance where the couples be out there dancing and it's something where the man get her and he turn her around oh, okay. God, oh, did he do this that's Chicago that's oh, Chicago but... step <laughs> I love the stepping I hate it <laughs> then they leave they and they leave, leave. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hate it you don't like that I dance. hate no I hate that I don't... then it's like she walk off and he bring her back and it's just like girl is that like the the black salsa? <laughs> but when now I'm just saying now, are you talking about the salsa? Or are you talking about the black? That's like the black it? salsa. You know what I'm talking about? That Chicago man. Yes, because I want to go to Chicago just so I can go to one of those stepping shows. I really do, y'all. I want to go to that, and I want to go to the players' ball. Where's it? Where's the players' ball? I think probably like in Detroit or somewhere. They got that? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, they be able to play ball with you know all the pimps because I really oh. do want to see all that. Hey, Natasha. So you want to go so they can get you? I just want to see what it's like. You know, they put on those suits and those hats. Get you, friend. No, they ain't gonna get me. <laughs> Let them pull them that money out them pockets. They gonna get you, friend. Baby, I'm too old to be on anybody's track, honey. Mm-hmm. I can't even be on a track and field. Hmm. Hey, Natasha. <laughs> okay, what's wrong with your girl Cardi? I don't know. She was see. I was trying to listen to her, but I can't listen to Cardi. Uh, it's just something where. The way she talk and all that, it just it drives me insane. So she was trying to talk about something I just couldn't hear, so I logged off. But I know they said she had to go to the hospital. Now you know she's pregnant too, so it's not her pregnancy. Yes, yeah, I don't know, girl. I don't know, but I was trying to listen to it. It was just too much. She probably with her being pregnant and stressing because they said you know, uh, oh yeah, he didn't left for she got a, she got a new time. place and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, I don't know, girl. This every time they break up, she go get a new house. Anywho, prayers to Cardi and everybody else. 
Okay. Honey, you see Sierra, honey, they getting thick. They having these babies and they getting real thick out here. Well, I Maybe mean. Cardi should have waited on having that surgery and then just had this last baby and then she would have been thick like Sierra and them thick and like Rihanna thick. You know, she couldn't wait. So she went on, went to the doctor and got her thickness then and her thickness then thick. And so she just should have had this baby then. Maybe the thickness would have thicked it like it should have. <laughs> the thickness would have thicked it. <laughs> you know what I'm I saying? Like she so, like that. Yeah. Oh, okay. It would have thicked it. Yeah, the thickness would have thicked it. Because see, my thickness thicked it. It thicked it. After it's I thickened. had my boy. <laughs> yeah. You barely on this thing. I'm barely on here, y'all. Barely. You ought to see how much room these hips done took up. That's all right. I mean, little booties do matter. <laughs> yeah, little booties matter too. Because they coming, they coming back, baby. They getting rid of the BBLs. They getting rid of the BBLs and slimming back down. And speaking of BBL, y'all see where they BBL and uh, coochies? Baby, I'm already fat cat. My baby dad. Oh, that's why I can't talk in the funeral rights. Jessie, she would not get to talk at my funeral. Because <laughs> the day she that. say how we met, she go into details. <laughs> y'all gonna just, that casket just gonna do this. Because <laughs> you coming back. I'm coming up out of there. Flowers gonna be. Cause I'm coming for your ass, <laughs> but yeah, now they doing BBLs on the coochies, y'all. Mm -hmm. They get injections. They want loose knuckles. I'm like, that's so crazy. They want loose knuckles and fat cats now. Yeah. So that just let me know that y'all gonna just take <laughs> pictures where y'all just showing y'all. Best thing you came on right in time, honey, because we're talking about those uh, injections where people get their oh. they, they vaginas yes. pumped up. Leave it alone. Let it go. <laughs> zip it. Zip it. Zip it. But I mean, like, that's just crazy work. Now, that's some crazy work. Does anybody know my, my, my daughter's dad? He called me fat cat. He'd be like, fat cat. Zip it. 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 Shadana, that's why I said Tiki would never get to talk at my film, my wake. She can't accept no award for me. Tiki talks too much. I just like to paint a picture and let everybody, you know, they want to see that. They, they want to paint a picture of that. <laughs> no, ma'am. Only your baby daddy. And I know. I remember one time when they asked, how many moose numbers? I'm like, what? Now, everybody want what I got. They want, I already got the ass. They want that. I already got, they want that now. I mean. <laughs> I ain't never been the same, baby. No, what's up, the friend? What's up, the son? They not like us. Girl, hush. <laughs> okay, free want me to get off the yes, topic, please, honey. <laughs> but yeah, they are doing. Yeah, this that's what I'm like. That's crazy. Now. I mean, girl, when I seen that pit, that picture. I was just like, I was taking a bag. So, baby, these leggings really finna be sold out now because now everybody gonna want you to see that they print. so good out here. I wish it was like it this does. every day. It does. It feels real good. It really we does. We should go and let them see us ride the scooters. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of riding, you had, you had something to say about driver's test. Well, yes. So, I talked to my friend and I need to get back in touch with him too because he worked over there at the, the driving school. Hey, Coco Boo! Hey, Coco! Um, he works over there, you know, for driver's ed and all that stuff where you get your license and permit and i was like they need to put on that test they need to put pictures of vehicles and you need to be able to identify if it's a car truck or an suv because i done seen it and heard it bro they have asked them what type of vehicle they have is it a car truck or suv and they don't be knowing if you don't be knowing what you driving you don't need to be driving you don't need to be driving because a crossover is a SUV. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Right, right. What kind of vehicle is it? Is it a car truck or SUV? Well, it's a RAV4. What it look like? <laughs> you you don't know? If it's a Jeep Wrangler, that's an SUV. Yeah. Like, they need to put that on that test. Because, see, I think somebody is just giving out permits over there. They're just giving them out. I, that's why I need to go work. Yeah. Because I'm telling when a kid be driving. Because little bunny head in there with lashes and stuff like that. I need all they driver's license picked back up, including yours. Because <laughs> she so had on the bunny Including yours. Because <laughs> you already said she'd be speeding, so I need hers back too. <laughs> she just slowed it down, though. She got a little better. Uh -huh. We got a police on of you. 
My baby life, that life 360 been my prayer. But yeah, that, they need to put that on their test. Because, honey, you're not knowing what type of vehicle you're driving. It, it just sends me. Yeah. Too grown for that. Yeah, I don't get it. So, can y'all tell us, because Tiki is having a fit about this. And it's about to take my poor friend out. Yes, it but really she want to know why there's so many people moving here to Arkansas. I know a lot of people saying it's cheaper here, um, cause she done seen tag after different tag after different tag after different I'm tag. I'm not, I'm not even looking at tags anymore. It's, it's, my anxiety is going up. I heard one. We don't have enough room here. Okay, that's what they said about Atlanta, but everybody's still going to. Come I know, here but I don't Atlanta. want them to start coming here. And then I, I like our freeways uncongested. Like, I hate driving in Dallas. I hate drive. Oh, my God. L.A., I couldn't drive. I love it. Baby, Derek was over there. I was, and then I was on some gummies. Oh, I love it. I was on my gummies. And I, I get was right in the middle of money, and I be gone. I my anxiety was, I, that's why, you notice when we was in L.A., I stayed high. Because it was just so much going, I just... Not you stay high. I mean, because it was never when we had to get out in that traffic. You I had to be rested. What, honey, where's is, where is Rhonda at? Your PR needs to step up. She's not stepping. Tiki is doing too much. Uh, Rhonda, I'm going to need you to call Tiki when we finish. You, you give her some words that she needs to use because she's she just not using the right words right now. Jesus. I was rested. Okay, yeah, I was rested because I just couldn't do it. And I don't want our freeways to start. I like how we can have space. Can I, I like how to get it somewhere? can be 10 car lengths in front of me. I don't want to start riding bumper to bumper and people jumping over in front. I don't want that for us here in Arkansas. So why are y'all coming here? There's nothing here. Okay. Please stop it. <laughs> for somebody that don't go nowhere. <sighs> hey, 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 Samaria. Hello, hello. And for y'all that's just tuning in, y'all probably missed the beginning. Today I am wearing my Uncle Tuck. Keep it cute says, or put it on mute. Unleash your inner tuck. These can be purchased. You know, we all have that family member who loves a good drink, and we love a good drink as well. So I want you guys to unleash your inner tuck. And you can go to Hot Tease Couture. That's H-A-U-T-E-T-E-E-S-C-O-U-T-U-R-E.com. And I have some other teas there as well. But I'm just, like, loving my Uncle Tuck. Um, yeah, we lost him back in the tornado that tore Color Station. And this is my way. And he used to cuss me out so much. I used to always ask for money. He'll cuss me out. Go. And look, go, y'all. I kind of feel bad about this. Now, why wouldn't you love that man cuss? I love See, him. Though. I like to make yes. him cuss me out. See, that's why I said she cannot talk at my funeral. <laughs> I like to make him cuss me out. She some stuff that I know I've done. <laughs> she won't get that chance. And I look, y'all, when the tornado, and unfortunately he was killed in the tornado when we were cleaning up. His house was damaged as well. Not my grandpa was. I said, "Granddaddy, Lo uh, uh, London, London, <laughs> no, ma'am, London, oh, no, ma'am, London." You do not like her voice. Thank you, TT's baby. That little raggedy professional. Thank you, TT's baby. <laughs> Patrice, Tiki be taking me. Like, Tiki take me too fast. But no, I'm just saying, this is my Uncle Chuck. But yeah, so honey, why did I know where his money was stashed in his house? So when we were cleaning up, I knew the spot. And I asked my granddaddy, he was like, well, it's wet, honey. I got all that money, threw it in that drawer. Thank you, Uncle Tuck. We miss you. And yeah. You did a great job, though, for Thank me. You, you really, you, you do amazing work. Thank you. Look. London, let me know if you like this one, London. Yeah. Oh, so, Tiki. And does. we also have uh -huh. Kamala Harris in Trump t shirts on the west side yeah. as well. So, pick she a does. Side and they're really cute. Uh -huh. Pick a side. So, let me see if London tour. likes my voice. So, yeah, London, like Tiki does really great work. And, like, yeah. she did some shirts for my grandbabies who are like Landon and Brayden. And so it was so amazing. <laughs> and, like, they wore those to school. And it was like, you know, like really cute. Well, Tiki did a great job. The design. Yeah, but then you, you know, print them out and stuff like that. And so you did really, really good. And they love them. They won't take them off. You know what I'm saying? So, London, you like my voice? Not at all. Because he could be driving me. <laughs> Girl, speaking of babies. Because <laughs> I think we're done with that conversation. Honey, I thought you was going to try to have you a bad <laughs> I told oh, she said I did that. great. Oh, thank you. Thank I love you, London, London. London. But um, y'all see what Dion Sanders be a granddaddy, but I'm like, Dion, you should. I thought you should have been. He should have been granddaddy. Cause he granddaddy looking, ain't he? 
And he got a granddaddy look. I used to love the. He's not like he not like Silver Fox looking. He granddaddy. He great granddaddy looking. <laughs> you think? I just love the young Sanders back in the day. He got his toe cut off. You still like him? I do. Okay, I was just checking. Now, what if your bank account you? ain't cut off? <laughs> 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 but yeah, so he welcomed his grandbaby, his first grandbaby, on his birthday. Oh, that is a blessing to share yes. with your grandbaby. Yeah, would you like to share your grandbaby? I would love to, cause I love my grandbaby. That's good. Yes, I love my baby. I know you do, but I just, mm-hmm. you know, yeah, I would love to I share. I don't, I don't want to share my birthday with Christmas, mm-hmm. but I need my stuff separated. <laughs> Like I used to tell my mom and them, separated sis. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't born on the 25th. Don't do, you're not doing it. Cause yeah, you messed up a lot. I mean, Christmas and then New Year's, they couldn't even go celebrate. New I mean, Year's. that's on them. They they <laughs> did what they did. But like I said, uh, the separated, separate the two. So they figured it out. Hey Kim, thank Hi, you for tuning in. Thank you y'all. Thank you for yeah, tuning in. Yeah, honey, this is so. a lovely day. Who is that sprinkle sign about? Mm-hmm. But yeah, y'all definitely need to go check out Tiki's t-shirts, you know, for um the um election. Yeah, they're right there. Pick a side, <laughs> I was baby. gonna say political thing. Kamala yeah, Harris. Pick a side. Or she or got Trump. some Kamala and she got some Trump t-shirts. You know, just because if you purchase Trump, she ain't gonna be mad. You know what I'm saying? My it's, cousin like my Trump design better. She said she almost bought his just because she liked his design better. Okay. So yep. yeah, y'all, we gotta make sure we get out there and vote, 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 vote. 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 You know, our votes do count. I don't want nobody to sit up not voting and they want to talk all this noise. Please don't. And I want to, like, y'all, and I'm still serious about this. I do want to run for something because, see, I want to be a lawmaker because I got me a lot too. of laws I want to put me in too. place. But I'm going to find me something to run for. Y'all going to vote for me if I run for something? I'll, don't play with me now. Don't play in my face. Because, you know, we'll little rock be playing in your face on their head. You sit up here getting business and then you got to go somewhere else and do other stuff and, I ain't got time for Lil Rock. <laughs> Lil Rock take it too fast. Well, Ken yeah. Richards' seat may be available, so you may want to check into that. Thank I mean, we're still sending prayers in, but I mean, I mean, if his seat comes open, maybe you can get in there. Let me see if I'm gonna get a few votes on here first. Would y'all vote? Oh, vote for sure me if I ran. Will. For I something. will definitely pin it. We did not put our comments, but I will definitely pin it. And thank you, love. Thank you. Ain't but nobody yeah. gonna vote for me. Cause see, I know y'all says, wait a minute, hold on. We gotta figure it out. Wait, no, I'm saying I would want to do it, but I know y'all said y'all would, would vote for me if I was over child support. See, I had got a lot of people said they would if I was over, over child think you, support. I think, we, I think you would have a good turnout. You think I would? I think so. Yeah, I said, it, it's me. Well, who is this over here? Who's over there? Because we know a lot of people that can, you know, you know, do some things. And but see, and I would be the one that would listen to my people. You know, because I'm all about helping people. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm always about that. I've hired friends and they need the jobs and stuff like that. And, then do my right, and I still hire people again. They don't do, you know what I'm saying? So I don't mind helping people. But well, when you get out, can you like limit how many people move into our state annually? I can't do that, friend. I know it's revenue for the state, but I'm just really, this is really driving. But yeah, I definitely want to be a lawmaker, and I feel like I, I can get in there and do some things, honey. And y'all can call me. I ain't gonna be the one to just come to your church. Oh, see, that's what I don't like doing. You know, during the voting time, they want to come to your church and then they don't come back. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like, baby, that my mama up. Yeah, see, I don't like that. You had several people that has done that. Mm-hmm. Came and sat with my family, ate with my family, you know. But they ain't been back. Mm-hmm. But, I mean, but we already thing. know it's a When hustle. they come back, just give them some sugar gave repeat. What is it, sugar gave repeat? <laughs> but, friend, you know if you get an <laughs> office, you know I got a law book, baby, because you know it's so much we be talking about, and I'm going to be throwing it at you. Put this on the table. Yeah. yeah. You, you know, know what? I got playing spades. I'm gonna be. I need to get in touch with Ken Richardson too, because you know when I did the Build Academy thing and I had to do my pitch competition, he said he really enjoyed my pitch competition. Well, then you go. And so I'm like, that's I need what to you need him. to do. You know, and especially with my son's name being Chemo, you know, his baby brother, may he rest in peace. Mm-hmm. His name is Chemo, right? So I probably have a good chance. Yeah, I'm right. gonna have to get in touch with old Ken. Yeah, you wanna go to the hospital? Is that where he at? I don't yeah. wanna go up there on COVID. Okay. We'll go by the house. Okay. You know how to get there? No. I don't think I know. Hey, oh, yeah, I do. I do. You know where it's at? Okay. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, I think I, I think he will sign me. I think so, too. I think you'll do great. What is it? Not sign me, but what is it? I think he will. Uh, what's Not the term that they use? Something of that nature. I, something is messy. Not that. What is it? Well, that's my sister. Hey, sister. Hey. What is it called? 
Okay, y'all, if y'all don't know, my sister's log in, my, my nephew TJ, I love my TJ. He is the so boys. smart. The boys. Let's get the boys back. TJ was doing multiplications at the age of two. He's moved on to division. Um, and TJ's just three. What was he for? I, you know, See what I'm old. saying? Look. But look here. Already. Baby, why is CJ doing sign language now and talking in another language? That is so good. But he is right here with a door sign. <laughs> she said he made it a bitch. <laughs> I know my nephew's He on his way. Oh, he's four. Thank you, sister. Yeah. And he's talking in another language, and that makes her mad because she don't now, know what the he's other saying. language. It ain't no baby language talk, is it? No. What are you doing? It's, it's what language, language is it, uh, India? And she gets mad because she don't know what he's saying. <laughs> so, you know what? We can teach him some EK Adelaide. Oh, yes. We're going to call TJ. He can EK early at that because my and great baby bae is on the EK Adelaide. SJ. SJ. I talk to you. I get in day, at day, in day, in day. Good guy. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then, you say, M-Hey? And then, ooh, yeah, and then, M-Hey, N-K, off tape. And his alma mate, on way, on they, on way, all your inside. S-J, S-J. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, y'all can do that. And it'll be you and him talking and not her. Oh, French and Spanish. Oh, I'm speaking in your poquito. It's French and Spanish. Oh, I've been your Paquito. I probably could say a little something with him. She yeah. swear. She swear. Her best friend taught her about five words and she swear. No, I took Spanish too, boo. I did too. You didn't retain it? I know my senior year, we had like five different teachers because our, see, I took our it class in was my so bad. Life. Our class was so bad, nobody wanted to teach us. But something. I took it in my adult life. Too. Yeah, I just said, never mind. Yeah. Because I don't need it. But through Espanol, I bless Espanol, paso menos. Mm hmm. It's sound, See, I it sound it. right. Well, let's go down. Let's go to the taco sales. Let me put my order in. I'm going to say it in English, though. Bye, y'all. And again, support Uncle Tuck. And I have some other teas. And I have some others that I'm going to be uploading because I may want to say it. Um, thick thighs save lives. Cause I'm saying and y'all, so. tell me why she got that. The, the thick thighs <laughs> save lives. She be wanting to wear them to work. <laughs> Not the Russian alphabet. See what Ooh. I'm saying? See, that's what I'm talking about. TJ is over there. See, that's good. <laughs> that's really good. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Indy. You're doing a great job, sweetheart. Keep it up. Let's keep nice it up. TTTJ. Oh, y'all, we about to get out of here because, honey, we don't want this uh, freshly firm, relaxed hair. Oh, no. It's still, it's, still, it's still from last time I did it. I just got that good thick curler. Yeah. I did just wash it, though. I didn't even curl it. Anyway. Just came up. Thank y'all Thank for y'all tuning, tuning in. in to the TV. Love, peace, and hair. And what they need to do? Share like, share like, share like. <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs>